we can use the idea of moments to help us do useful jobs and lift heavy loads. And we do this using levers. A lever is a force multiplier. And it means that we can exert a small force and apply that at a large perpendicular distance from the pivot. Now this will cause a large moment. And this large moment can move heavy objects. So in this example here, we've got a, a chap pushing down on a long lever. So the perpendicular distance from the line of action of the force to the pivot. Where's the pivot? Well, the pivot is just there. So we've got a long distance. So we're going to create a very large turning force. Now, we're using that large moment to lift a heavy load. Now, the load is applying a force just at the tip of this lever. So let's see if we can just show this a little bit more clearly. So here's our lever. And there's our pivot. Now, we're pushing down here with a force. So there's the line of action of our force. The perpendicular distance from the pivot to the line of action of the force is there. And we've got a great big load on the edge here. So we've got some kind of big load here. Now that means there's a, a very, very big force. We call it the weight force of the load. But notice that the perpendicular distance from the pivot to the line of action of that force is very small. Small distance. So that means that we can have a very large weight multiplying a very small distance and that could balance a, a small force over a large distance. So let's see if I can show that in words. So a small force, what we would call the effort force, multiplied by a large distance. Now if it's balanced, then these must equal each other because this would be the anti-clockwise moment, small force, the effort force times the large distance. And on the other side, we've got the clockwise moment. So this is going to be a large load force multiplied by a small distance, a small perpendicular distance. And they balance each other out. And this means that we can lift very heavy loads using a lever, which has a long distance from the line of action of the force to the pivot. And that causes a large moment and that can help us to move heavy objects. So make sure that you can describe how a lever works using the idea of, of a lever as a force multiplier and that a small force is applied at a large perpendicular distance from the pivot. This creates a large moment and that can move heavy objects.